up, YouTube? It's your boy, Double A Nice Skills. Welcome back to another one of my FIFA 20 Ultimate Team videos. I hope you guys are having a fantastic day. Today, we got top 100 rewards, the big one, the beast ones, the beastly top 100 rewards. And I want to talk to you guys because I know there's a little bit of confusion. I kind of want to give you guys how it's breaking down, what it's looking like. The Summer Heat promo. And the reason I want to bring this up is because I really, really want to break down this promo and not only break down this promo but what we can expect from weekend league rewards going forward so real quick what we're gonna do is jump into top 100 rewards and then after that i'm gonna bring you back here to show you guys what you guys can get during the weekend league and if it's worth playing the weekend league during summer summer heat promo so with that being said let's jump into the top 100 rewards and i'll see you back here in two minutes all right my boys i gotta get a huge huge shout out to my boy col max that's my homie man that's the man that's part of my col team with me i am signed to col i rep col those are my homies man complexity i've been with them for over a year now man as you can see my jerseys on the wall right there i got more jerseys this is my teammate he has been slaying it in the weekend league he pulls off another top 100 finish and we are gonna get some uh hey sanjo that's not a bad pool man some big team of the season ultimate um this is the last ultimate team of the season i believe um rewards now i am gonna speak to you guys of the structure of the new best of team of the season uh, uh weekend league rewards and let you know if i truly believe you should play weekend league going forward these rewards here have been okay we got Carvajal, we got sancho um i'm gonna be honest with you the things i'm gonna say in this video when we get to that point and when i show you guys the breakdown of what ea sports has given us this is pretty good kimmich o block and that boy henderson kimmich a pretty good car but he goes with o block um the things i'm gonna say and this is one thing i need y'all to understand about this man is um yes i've been doing uh fifa youtube since 2011 yes i've top 100 yes i've made pro events yes I, I i have a little bit of an audience but all that is completely irrelevant because at the end of the day i'm just a dude that sits in his basement and records videos and gives opinions i know as much about fifa as the next person i know as much as about fifa as you do i don't know more than you you don't know more than me we're just dudes who hang out and play fifa or girls that hang out and play fifa and it's all just an opinion at the end of the day and my opinion that i'm going to say in a minute when we get to that point of speaking about um you know the, the the weekend league rewards um is strictly simply an opinion it doesn't actually mean anything the, the other day when i made a rant video as well okay we get blue baby argentinian blue oh that could have been a big messy dude um the other day when i gave my big opinion on uh, or my, my my rant video and and i ranted about certain things and so many people in the comments down below was all oh, everything skill set here is facts and everything this and people tweeted me I didn't, I didn't really want it to people to say it's not facts because facts is when you give somebody, you know, actual proof in it, 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 it. Like, no, it was my opinion. Everything that was said in that video about why FIFA 20 for me is worse than FIFA 19 and 18 and 17 um, is an opinion. It's not actually, it, does, it means nothing. So many people, for so many, you might not believe this, but there's going to be at least 15, 20, 30% of people out there that actually think FIFA 20 or maybe even 80% is better than FIFA 19, 17, 18 going backwards. A lot of people like FIFA 20. And 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 that's the great thing about us getting releases every single year. That's the one thing I can say that's great about EA Sports is as much as we hate on them and as much as we give them stick because I give them a lot of stick, you know, they release the game every single year. So this game could have sucked for us and for some people it was great. And we'll get another one very soon and we'll see if that one's good. But again, everything I say in my my opinion, in my videos are straight opinions. I don't think I'm smarter than anybody. I don't think I've played this game longer. And it doesn't matter if I play this game longer. More people, I've could I played this game since I was a baby. You know what I'm saying? I've been playing it for a very, very long time. It doesn't mean I know more than you. It means nothing. You could have played this game for two years and know more than me. You could have done your research better than me. So I'm going to give my opinion. I'm going to show you guys exactly from EA's website. Oh my God, that's a pink. Spanish pink right wing wow that's not even a pink it's an orange why did it look pink to anyways um i'm gonna give you guys you know straight from the ea website the breakdown of what you get for eve every single um you see this this looks cool man everything in packs but it's still kind of a dead pack i'm gonna give you guys the breakdown of every single you know thing that ea says from gold one to silver two where you finish what you get and i'm gonna give you my opinion on that now my boy max got one more pack for us here man the ultimate team of the season pack to end off top 100 awards for team of the season as they switch into the best 11 i guess we're calling it and this is not even gonna be wait a minute wait a minute oh 
VVD, they're showing pink, it's the glitch. Yo, VVD, that's huge, dude. Yo, grats, man, 99 rated VVD. Oh, that's incredible, man. Oh, man, 99 rated big boy VVD. Grats, man, if you guys wanna check out Max, I'm gonna leave his Twitter down below. With that being said, let's go ahead and break it down. What else is in there? Hey, not bad, man. Not bad. I'm going to go ahead and break down. Yo, Trent as well. Let's break down what rewards are looking like. That is huge. Insane 99 rated team of the season pool and top 100 rewards. Let's go, man. Let's talk about rewards and we can. All right. So now that we're done with the top 100 rewards, this is the Summer Heat promo. They break it all down, man. Summer Heat special items, best re-releases, best whatever, Summer Heat fans, blah, 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 blah. All the jumbo packs, loyalty, whatever, whatever, whatever. This is for getting, you know, for playing the game that gave out rewards. But then it comes to the weekend league rewards. It says during the during the summer heat weekend league rewards, uh, player pick packs will contain special items in FIFA 20 campaign throughout the year. Um, so this is how it's gonna break down. We'll start down here. Silver two to silver three. Any players? Th I, first of all, I want to say I love this. I love this because it lets you know whether i think the fact that a lot of people stop at gold one and just give up they're like all right gold one's enough i can get the same reward to somebody else i actually hate that i legitimately hate that i think that you should reward people that want to get better finishes and don't just stop a lot of people stop at gold one they can keep going but they just stop at like 14 wins or 20 wins because they're like well the same chance i have of finishing here is the same as top 100. now nah, you should make people want to get top 100 anyways that's neither here nor there uh we start silver to say any players items uh earn a player pick pack will uh be from the above list and it says whatever um a maximum rating of 88. A maximum rating of 88 from silver two to silver three. Silver one, any player, player, play, 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 will be a rated 83 or higher. So you can get an 83 or higher rated uh, from your player pick packs if you finish silver one. Gold two and plus. Uh, players will, will uh, get a minimum of one special item from the above list selected FIFA 20 campaign. A 90 or higher rated player from gold two and up. Now, Finishing gold two seems to be the big target here, in my opinion. If you can get gold two or higher, it's a W. It's a 90 rated card. Now, let's be honest, there's a million 90 rated cards in FIFA 20. But at the same time, at least you know what you're playing for. This is very, very important, in my opinion, man. A lot of the times we go through FIFA and none of us really know what we're playing for. We really know what you're going to You don't know what you're going to get. It's completely random. This structure kind of gives you a reason to run it, it gives you a reason to play the weekend league. Elite three to elite one. Um, the team of the season so far, a three player pick packs will be placed with a best of three player pack containing three special items rated 90 or higher from the above. So, um, so I guess what they're saying here It'll be three team of the season player pick packs will be replaced by three of the best. So your player pick team of the season packs are gone. Now it's just best of, um, which is crazy. It could be good. It could be bad. Again, I did like the fact that I think all year last year, we got team of the seasons throughout the entire year. Um, but that kind of gets replaced, which kind of sucks. Uh, but, you know, maybe we don't know what the best are going to look like. Maybe team of the seasons pop a lot. We don't know. Now, if you get top 100, you get 11. Uh, the 11 team of the season player pick packs will be replaced by 11 best, I right? And the best will contain 11 players that are 90 rated or higher. So that's what you're playing for if you play the weekend league. Is it a W? Is it an L? Um, it's a W if EA don't scam people. Now, what does that actually mean? It means what I said, right? A lot of times EA Sports will say, hey, you know what? Look, this weekend, team of the season, um, this weekend rewards team of the season, you can pack Ronaldo. And like one Ronaldo will come out and everybody gets the lowest rated ones. You know, if you at 90 rated, it could be, you could get 11 hot, like shapeshifter cards or even um, the Halloween promo. I think the Halloween promo had some 90 rated cards probably. I don't know, what, what was Ebra's Halloween card? Ebra's Halloween card might've been, um, I don't even know what it was. Let me pull it up real quick. Ebra, Ebra's Halloween card um, was, I'm gonna pull it up on this screen real quick. Ebra's Halloween card was a 88 rated, so you can't even get that card. But you can get Ibrahimovic's, um, 
winter refresh card, which it only goes for 200K. Um, so realistically, this is an L if you were to hit this card, um, especially this deep in FIFA. If you don't have players worth, you know, um, if you don't have players over 90 pace, I just don't really see the point. So going down this list real quick with you guys, um, you know what I'm saying? We'll kind of go to lead to probably what page will the 90 start at? Probably page like, I would say around page 15, maybe 13, where the 90 starting at? Real, real close. 16 puts us in the 91s. So here you go, man. You start to see a lot of the icons, which are 90 rated. And then you get to hear, you get the boy, um, you get the boy uh, 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 Lewandowski, 100K. Lewandowski again for 60K. A 60K, 60K. This one's 100K. That's that boy VVD, 90 rated. Grizzly at 100K. PK at 129. Um, so as you can see, there is not many cards worth the value. Um, so it really comes down. There's David Luiz at 600K. Uh, Timo Vorn at 300K. Um, it really, really, really is going to come down to one thing what ea gives people if you pull an immobile if you pull a courtois and ibrahimovic this is all an l man literally all an l here even sonaldo's going for 400 that's kind of a w you got ben yetter you got uh Kimmich. so cards like this yeah maybe you know what i'm saying maybe hit something like that if those i, I don't even know if those type of cards are going to be in it um but pretty much what i'm trying to say like if there's an arturo in there which is a flashback which was an spc like if that's in there then who knows i don't know if that's going to be in or not to be honest with you guys um does it even say if it'll be in, if it'll be like all of that? Look, man, this whole situation here, it's a little bit of a W and it's a huge L. Um, to play 30 games of weekend leagues and not get team of the seasons and then get replaced by the best. Um, honestly, this doesn't really make sense to me because the best of 11, I'm going to be honest with you, the best of 11 is team of the season, right? Does that, is, does that make sense to y'all or am I crazy? Like you go through the season to award team of the seasons that's the best team of the seasons are the best at this point they were the best ones you picked from each you know what i'm saying um now they're obviously saying the best of which means they're going through every single promo but every single promo at this point is kind of irrelevant um so the concept behind summer heat is okay like it's a cool concept but at the same time there's a little bit of l's in there as well because it doesn't really make sense the best of even if you look at the best of promos, it's team of the year and team of the season. Like the rest of the promos are kind of irrelevant at this point. But there is some shape shifters that go for more than team of the season. So, I mean, either which way, no matter how you look at it, as you guys can see, there's, there's, a, there's a ton of 90s, bro. There's a lot of 90s in this game. And there's a lot of really, really bad 90s, like this one, for example. So it just depends how EA Sports hands out the rewards. I'm hoping... I'm going for top 100 this weekend league. I promise you that. But I'm hoping they don't do this to people. Because if they lob this for people, then all of a sudden you're hitting a player that's going for 48K and just absolutely completely irrelevant. irrelevant. That's my opinion. Summer Heat has potential. They put everything into packs. That's kind of cool. Um, you know what I'm saying? They didn't fix drafts, which is an L because drafts is supposed to be the main attraction of, you know, in my opinion, the main attractions of, of, of team of the season. Um or excuse me, of, of the summertime. Like that's just where the fun's at. Um, they also removed, you know what I'm saying? I think that what they should have done here, let me let me, let me me tell you how this should be phrased. It should say this in my opinion. Um, the 11 team of the season players have been replaced with five of the best and six of team of the seasons. That's how I think it should be worded. Here, it should be elite should get two team of the seasons and one best and then gold and then on you see what i'm saying that's how i think it should be played it should be half and half some team of the seasons some the best that way people still have a chance at team of the seasons now obviously team of the seasons could pop up in the best but we got to see if they do so that's my opinion um don't want to repeat myself anymore like i said but I, that's how i really really feel man so we'll see how it plays out uh is it worth playing weekend league i say yes for at least one more weekend then we see what the rewards look like and then we go from there, man. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, smash that big old thumbs up. Make sure to subscribe. I love you guys so much. And I appreciate you guys watching. That is my opinion on the best of the Summer Heat Weekend League rewards. I love y'all.